Accenture is positioning itself at the forefront of the emerging agentic AI wave by expanding its partnership with NVIDIA to leverage advanced AI capabilities within its operations. The company is launching the Accenture NVIDIA Business Group, which will employ an army of agents to tackle complex workflows, enhance efficiency, and deliver customized solutions for clients. While agentic AI presents significant opportunities for an innovation, Accenture acknowledges the challenges of data security, ethical considerations, and the necessity for human oversight as these systems become increasingly autonomous. Yep, it's an interesting world that we live in here. And I, I want to I want to actually focus on one funny thing here. You say that they're employing an, an army of agents. Yes, yes, they have an army of agents. They're called uh, the Accenture professionals. Yeah, but, but it's funny, of course, because you know, you could read this and you could think, well, are these agents humans or are they AIs? You know, I mean, what is Accenture doing here? So it seems to me that in this case, Accenture is planning on helping businesses to deploy agentic AI with a partner, NVIDIA. But of course, there's a lot more to this than meets the eye. Now, I recently gave a talk at uh, Field Day, uh, which you can view Um I will include the links in the show notes here. Um, I actually am going to publish this uh, same day that this episode goes out called What is Agentic AI? Uh, so if you're listening to this and you're like, wait, Agentic, what is Stephen even talking about? Well, essentially, the idea is that rather than just having AI be a tool that you use, Agentic AI is where you deploy autonomous agents that can act on your behalf and do things for you. So it's sort of like process automation in that essentially they sit there and lay and wait until you activate them and then they sort of do a task that you've prescribed to them. But in this case, they are all essentially AI bots that are waiting. So for example, you could have an agent that watches the price of flights and then pulls the trigger when the, when the flight price reaches a certain level. And you might not have to specify that level. You might just have to say, buy me a ticket to Boca when the price is good and I can get there in the morning. And it'll sort of figure it out for you based on that. Now, that's a simplified version and most agentic AI is actually not gonna work anything like that. In fact, the agentic AI that they're talking about here deploying would be much more like the process automation stuff that you get from ServiceNow or from Salesforce or from some of the other companies that I've recently spoken with and written about on LinkedIn. Um, these companies are essentially the next generation of process automation for businesses where you would have a fleet of autonomous agents that would do supply chain or sales automation or marketing automation type tasks for you. And those agents essentially would sort of have a, a hierarchy. And I think this is another aspect of agentic AI that's important. They would have a sort of a, a hierarchy from special purpose agents, you know, like maybe an agent that understands email messages or an agent that can compose email messages. And then you would have sort of orchestration agents that would be able to employ those agents. So we're talking to AI using AI. So imagine if when you're talking to ChatGPT, you could say, you know, hey, ChatGPT, you know, what's the price of NVIDIA? How much has the price of NVIDIA gone up in the last 10 years? And ChatGPT would talk to a special stock uh, market agent who would then go retrieve that data. And then the stock market agent would talk to a calculation agent that would be able to actually do the math correctly. That, that's what we're talking about. And I think that that is a pretty interesting prospect for a lot of businesses. Also, I think Accenture, NVIDIA, and many others are hoping that it's gonna be the next big wave. Um, we've talked about retrieval augmented generation, which is essentially a chat bot that can access your um, internal data set and answer questions based on that data. Well, I think um, agentic AI is another wave that people are hoping to see deployed in the, in the enterprise. And that's why Accenture is getting involved here. So overall, um, you know, I'm not surprised Accenture is getting involved here, but I do want to come back to that first bit. Accenture is deploying an army of agents. Honestly, if I was in charge of Accenture, I would absolutely be deploying an army of AI agents to do a lot of the tasks that we currently, that Accenture and businesses like that have, come, have, have, have human employees working on right now because a lot of those things are repetitive and could be automated. And frankly, I would be shocked if Accenture wasn't doing this to improve profitability theoretically and reduce staffing, unfortunately. So 
uh, yeah, they're deploying an army of agents to deploy agents at companies, but I bet they're also deploying an army of agents to save themselves money. 